Hi, this is the Phoenix from Phoenix Rise and Tarot. Here to do another 40, no, sorry, weekend energy update for the sign of Sagittarius. Just keep in mind, these are general readings. They're not going to resonate with all of you, but for the ones that it does resonate with, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. For those of you interested in a personal reading with me, all the information will be in the description box below. This is going to be for the Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs of Sagittarius. So let's jump into this reading and see what messages are coming to for you guys from Spirit. Spirit messages for the sign of Sagittarius. Messages for the sign of Sagittarius. <coughs> messages for the sign of Sagittarius. Mm, that's a lot. All right, so we have a lot. Mm -hmm. So we have the age of light. You've been training for this for lifetimes. Then we have align your soul. What is not aligned or needs to change. There is something that needs to be in alignment for something else to happen. Trust the niggle. What is the niggle feeling trying to tell you? What is your gut telling you? What is your intuition telling you? Where are you being called to journey to? What direction is your life pulling you towards that you are resisting? Get grounded. Empaths, highly sensitive, connect with nature. Some of you need to take a nature walk or connect with a tree. Share your voice. Come out of the cave. Persecution expression. All right, so let's see. Who may be influencing this weekend? Or oh, this read. Let's see what comes out for you guys. Spirit messages for the sign of Sagittarius. Messages for the sign of Sagittarius. Let's see what it has here. Courtship, gift, message of concern, bad health. Yeah, it's a lot. I'm not taking them. Spread one more card for the sign of Sagittarius. Why are you guys trying to say so much to Saji? Alright, at the bottom of the deck we have teeth in reverse. So there seems to be some trust issue in this connection. All right, the first card out is house. So you want to feel secure in this connection. You want to feel at home. Oof. Okay, so we have mature, uh, mature woman. This could be you. This could be somebody you're dealing with. But this person may be older than you um, or wiser than you. Someone that may have a business. Uh, could be a boss. You have journey. So you are embarking on a new journey right now, probably with this person or away from this person. Some of you could be leaving your home and your parents to go on a journey because you're expecting something. Because you're feeling depressed about someone finding out that they may have been fake or that the truth about this connection was something that you may not have seen. All right, these are a lot of cards. Let me just make some room for them. All right, so let's see. Let's see how the energies play off of each other here. All right, so someone that you probably thought that was fake caused you some pain and depression. You were waiting and expecting to find out that this person was what you thought they were. And in the interim, you realized or found out that this person may be nothing like you thought they were. Hmm. They may have been married, though. And had a commitment at home. That is for some of you, not all of you. For some of you, this person may be ready to leave their home or to have you move in with them 
but there is a new path that you are definitely going to be taking soon or this person may be taking towards you so we'll see what comes through in the tarot messages for Sagittarius spirits messages for the sign of Sagittarius okay so we have the nine of pentacles in the reverse but it was flipped <clears throat> if it's meant to come back out it will but some of you you are in a relationship or you're in a situation ship some of you oh okay wow okay okay all right so something happened you had a tower moment a realization of some sort could be a scorpio you're dealing with um but something shook you to your very core and definitely shattered your illusions because did, yeah you may have taught something about someone and it wasn't necessarily true that realization shook you to your very core um you're not sure if you're willing to build anything again with this person but i think you wow why are they flipping okay but this new part that you are on you're, you're trying to heal from the past you're trying to find your own happiness for some of you you see this person as your wish come true but after what happened in the past between you and them you can't see this relationship working out at all there may have been harsh words spoken yeah this person may be ignoring you this person is trying not to recognize you or show you any type of recognition. Could be a twin flame or a soulmate. Could be a Gemini also. But you thought this connection may have been fake or this person may have been fake. But I think you realize that it wasn't. Could have something to do with a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, or you stepping into the energy, or your person stepping into the energy of using their head over their heart when making decisions and cutting out what no longer serves them. You or your person need to make a decision though, because you're at a stalemate. Mm, at a stalemate on wondering, do I give this relationship another chance or not? The unsurety is if to give this relationship a try again. There was a lot of quarreling and fighting between you and this person. Yeah. Someone felt left out. Someone felt abandoned. And someone just literally felt hurt. But someone wants to work on the connection now and one of you or both of you could be spying on each other online or passing by someone's house or looking for the truth trying to find out what is the truth because somebody is willing to put in the work now to save the connection after a time of separation of one of you being single or both of you being single and independent and taking care of yourself you may be ready to leave the past behind and forget all that had happened and have a relationship with this person commit to this person commit to this relationship yeah come out of the anxiety and the depression But you're not sure how this person feels because i think they're barely communicating with you you don't know what this person really feels you know a cycle has opened after another one was closed but you can't seem to find the strength 
to confront this person or to tell this person that you want to save this connection now or that you want a second chance with them. I think for some of you, you are doubting that this person will give you a second chance or that they still love you because this person isn't taking any action towards you. So you feel stuck. Yeah. You don't know if there will be a new beginning or not between you and them. And that has you feeling kind of stuck. Oh, what is the most likely outcome for the sign of Sagittarius spirit? Give me some advice for my Sagittarius spirits. Advice to Sagittarius. Hmm. At the bottom of the deck we have home. So somebody feels safe with you. You feel safe with someone. You feel like you're at peace and you're at home when you're with this person. Ooh, okay, so this guy is a gorgeous one. You may be sexually attracted to this person. Because he is gorgeous. <clears throat> you don't want it to end. But you don't know how to make that wish for it to begin again. Mm-hmm. So this is what I have for you guys. I hope it helps. Have a good one.